You guys, who would have ever thought those chia pets, you know, with the sprouts that grew, would be something we would eat. They're loaded with antioxidants. So I'm gonna share a healthy, delicious recipe for you, perfect for after Thanksgiving when you're still craving something yummy, but you don't wanna put on the extra pounds. Here's what you're gonna need. Oat milk or almond milk, cacao, just straight chocolate powder, no um, sugar. Chia, of course. Something to sweeten it with, I recommend maple syrup and cinnamon. And vanilla if you have it, but I happen to be out of it. And a little salt. Salt is super bad for you, FYI. Now, I'm gonna make these in some jars. I just save old jars because chia is water soluble. So when you put it with a liquid, it absorbs all of that liquid and it swells up and that's what makes it like a pudding. When we put it in the fridge, we're gonna wanna shake it after like five minutes. Otherwise, it's all kinda gonna sink to the bottom. And then you'll need, you know, a mixing bowl and measuring utensils and a whisk. Okay, let's start. You're gonna put in a quarter cup of the cacao. Cacao is just another way of saying cocoa. My mom looked it up once. A tablespoon of the syrup. You can put in more if you want. I don't like things really sweet. I'm just gonna use one tablespoon. Then if you have vanilla, add the vanilla, but I don't have any. Then put a half teaspoon of cinnamon. Then just a pinch of salt. Just pour like a tiny bit in your hand and sprinkle it in like magic dust. And now you're gonna put in one and a half cups of oat milk, but as we discussed before, it is hard to mix a powder and a liquid. So we're just gonna start with the half cup first and it'll be a little easier to combine. And then we'll add the cup later. How are you guys doing? Did you have a good Thanksgiving? I hope so. I know it was different this year, but let's not complain, okay? Let's look at this year as an opportunity to change and grow. I love it. I love challenges. I love changing and growing. I have a lot of growing to do, so I welcome the opportunity. This year has been eye-opening for me. I hope it has been for you, too. We got it all mixed up. Now we're going to add the chia seeds. A half cup of chia, and it's so easy. All we do is add these few ingredients, mix them up, put them in the fridge overnight, and voila, we're gonna have a delicious chocolate pudding for breakfast. You can eat it for breakfast. I do, and if I do it, you should do it. <laughs> do you remember the chia pets, by the way? If you're my age, you do. If you're younger, you should Google it because they're really cute. Now we got it all mixed up. And basically, this is it, it's done. So now we're gonna pour it into our jars. You could put it in the fridge like this, and then after five minutes, just whisk it up again. And then maybe again after 10 minutes, but I'm gonna pour it in the jars so I can shake it. I'll show you how to shake it. Okay, let's pour it in the jar. It's perfect. And I'm gonna just get everything out so we don't waste anything. Waste makes haste. I never knew what that meant. I never know what expressions mean. I'm one of those people that uses them all wrong. Now we're gonna put the lid on. And if you were to not use a jar and just put it in a contain in your bowl, just cover it up, okay? I'm gonna stick this in the fridge. I need a cameraman who could follow my every move. Do I have any volunteers? Okay, so we're gonna wait five minutes, and then we're gonna shake it up. I'll be right back. Okay, so let's go get the jar. Taking it out of the fridge, and I'm just gonna shake it. So after five minutes, and then again after 10 minutes, shake it up. And go to bed. Go to bed. Get some rest. Take good care of yourself. Then wake up in the morning, or if you're like me, and tomorrow is a Saturday, you'll wake up at noon. <laughs> And your chia pudding will be all done. Okay, you're welcome. You're gonna love it. I would love to hear in the comments how much you loved it. Please subscribe to my YouTube. Have a great weekend, guys. Take good care of yourself. Stay positive. Get outside. Get lots of rest. Breathe.
breathe in some deep breaths. We're going to be okay. Everything's going to be okay. See you soon. Thanks for watching.